It's Raynon with the return. Ball's loose. A huge turn of events. The ball's going back the other way. This game is still about hitting. When you hit the other team hard enough, that football comes loose. Nice job by the kicking team. They make the hit, and they recover the fumble. Great job. Hey, the offense has a chance to do something with this drive. Here we go. First and ten. Murray's going to take the handoff now. That picks up 11. When a coach can have a run, it picks up those kind of yards. It gives them confidence, and they will show more and more patience with the running game. So the defense, they better dig in here. They're able to move the chains after that last run. They've come out in the dime package. Here we go now. Hold on. And he's thrown to the ground. How about the defense on that play? They were not fooled. They see the pass coming. They get the penetration. They get to the quarterback quick. And that's a big sack down near the goal line. Makes the catch. Got what he wanted. Touchdown. Protection was outstanding all day to throw it. And then finally, the quarterback found the open receiver, put it on target. Nice touchdown throw. The Eagles with an extra point try on the way. Add the extra point. The kick is good. The Eagles are going to get lined up to kick it off. The offense is pleased with that last scoring drive, but the defense really made it happen, doing the heavy lifting by forcing the fumble and giving them great field position. Runs up to grab it at the four. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. So the rookie quarterback will take the field, trying to improve week by week. Well, he, he's getting some experience. It's not a lot, but it's enough to help him feel more comfortable and I think play better. He should do well here today. Double tight end formation. First down at the 23. Makes the reception. There's no doubt, time of possession can be an overrated stat in games many times. But one thing you want to do, throw and catch it just like this to pick up those first downs and keep it going. The Jets continue to find themselves in games that come down to the wire. A week ago, they secured a victory, but they trail on this one right now, partner. In the NFL, your whole season really evolves around how you play in the close games. If you don't perform well in the close games, you're not going to go to the playoffs. And that's the type of run I think this offense would take all game long, Phil. Oh, would they ever. They would love this. This is this is showing your dominance here. The offensive line doing a good job, but also a solid job by the running back picking up some good yards. The Jets will take the snap from the 45. It's over to Welker, and now they'll be on the other side of the 50 after this play. So with that play, they move into enemy territory and driving here early stages. Well, look, I I'm going to blame the defense. They're being so passive. you got to go out there and take some chances. If you don't, this offense is going to keep marching down the field. They'll go shotgun here. And he's taken down. Well, I know this feeling. When a blitzer's coming, nobody's there to block him. There's nothing you can do as a quarterback, but try to protect yourself because you're going down. Amaro's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. Third and eight. He's churning ahead. Ball's thrown incomplete. Great coverage there by the defense. This is what separates offensive lines in the NFL in obvious passing situations like this one on third down. Can you hold up and protect your quarterback to give him time to make those throws? 
Well, the answer to this one right now is no. Bradford's taking the field now. This is his sixth season as a quarterback in the NFL. They come to the line, and it's first down. There we go now. Murray. They are all over him, behind the line of scrimmage, and a loss of one. Here's our look at the Eagles' offense. A week ago, they had no ability to hold on to the football, giving it away four times. Second down here after that run play. DeMarco Murray is in the backfield. He'll take the snap from the gun. Out to the left. Incomplete. Almost going in the other direction. This linebacking core is the heart and soul of this defensive unit. The offense now needs to pick up the first here on third down after that incompletion. Ready, green, 39. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. Looks to his left. The pass is off the mark, and that's a three and out. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third and long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Fields it cleanly and starts his return. Tackle down at the 42-yard line. First down, offense ready for the snap. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. And Ivory's got it on the handoff. They bring him to the turf. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. That's second down coming up. Split backfield here. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Gets the handle here. He's going to be tackled right around the 24-yard line. Jeff's offensive line will be whooping it up tomorrow when they watch this play in the field room. What a good job by them. Excellent planning and awesome execution. The Jets bring in an extra tight end for this play. The Jets have it at the 24. And Ivory's marked down at the 19. Here's our look at the Jets' offense. Last week, they were motoring up and down the field, throwing for over 350 yards. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Second down and six. Back to the ground. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. Good job by the offense getting the first down in the red zone. Now becomes tricky. Can you deceive the defense where you get a chance to get a score? Offense lines up here. First down and 10. Middle, and he's brought to the ground. After being stuffed at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and 10. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. Hand off, left side. And that's a gain of 10. They keep fighting for every inch, every yard, as they move closer and closer to the end zone. Now this offense, they fit perfectly with the head coach. He's a tough guy. He's a grinder. And this offense, what a job here right now. They are grinding this football, like you said, right down the field. The defense is ready to plug up the middle here on the goal line. From the shotgun, throwing now to his left. Touchdown, New York Jets. Touchdown, New York. 
There's no doubt about it. When you score like that to tie up the game, it shifts momentum. And it's all up now to the offense of the other team to get back out there and get the momentum back on their side. Jets getting ready for the kickoff. Murray's running this one out. And they stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. It's first down as they head to the line. There you go now. Blue 45. Out of the shotgun formation. To the sideline and complete. Well, when you talk about throwing these sideline routes or the out route, it is about timing. When that receiver makes that break to go towards the sideline, that football has to be in the air. Nice throw and catch that time. Offense lines up here. First and ten. And the give now to DeMarco Murray. And there's only two yards to be found right there. You've got to give a lot of credit to the defense. They were all over the run that time, and they only give up a short gain. Second and eight. DeMarco Murray gets the handoff. And the tackle is made at the 35-yard line. Murray's trying to be patient, but there is nowhere to run that time, and he only gets a short game. Marshall's in the slot. Bradford's back in shotgun formation. The catch is made, and he's tackled down after picking up the first. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down. Jim, that's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. Here we go now. The Eagles take it from the 43. Gets his feet down right near the chalk. Well, they complete the pass, Jim, but doesn't get the first down. Sooner or later, you got to throw one down the field. The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. Offense lines up here. Ready! They'll go ground. The tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. Murray's a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. The Eagles take it from the 43. Bradford gets it over to Danny Amendola. He is tackled at the 40-yard line. Anytime you have man-to-man -man coverage like we see this time, it's all about the receiver getting away from the defender. He does it, and the quarterback puts it right on. And that will close out the first quarter in Philadelphia. We'll return in just a moment. This is brought to you by Verizon. Never be without football. Not a whole lot of scoring here as we welcome you back to the action. Second down here. Sam Bradford will Green, be under center. Green, 90. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Catch made. offense like this that just keeps getting first downs not only are they move it in scoring position but they're giving their defense a lot of rest first down here after the completion here's the first snap after the big play Murray's taking the handoff Friars there that time for the tackle if I'm on the defense and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that it is a run. If they have the courage to throw it, let them. If they do, of course, it'll be a touchdown. Defense ready in the goal line formation on this one. Second and goal to go. from, And he's in for the touchdown. Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. They got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. The Eagles lined up now for the point after. Count it. The 
Jets are ready to return the kick. Raynard will drop to a knee, and this will come out to the 20. The Jets are getting set for their next possession. The defense comes out of the nickel. Now first and ten. Here's the handoff. He's tackled right at the 24. And it'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. Offense lines up here. And Ivory's going to secure the handoff. They'll mark him at the 28. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. Now looking at third down. Wide receivers are bunched up. Reaches out and snatches it. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. Well, I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. An open lane. They get to him just in time. One yard shy of the first down. There's going to be an injury timeout here. We'll take a quick break and be back in just a moment. Geno Smith under center. Three, 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 three. Second and short. And Ivory's handed the football. Hey, that's a great job by the defense. What an effort. And what speed that time they get in the backfield to tackle the runner for a loss. It'll be third down. Chris Ivory lined up in the backfield. There's a momentum killer right there. The flag comes out. I think we have a false start. Boy, coaches talk about it so much. Penalties before the snap of the ball. We got to avoid them. And the biggest one of all is the false start. Third down after the penalty. Smith is in the shotgun. Throws to the right. Incomplete. The Jets are going to call on the punting team. backed up Marshall's a receiver in the slot first and ten Murray brought down just two yards shy of the first down marker power running a lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore this team they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards second down two to go Murray's gonna take the handoff now He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Murray's a great running back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances. First down here after the run. Nickel formation for the defense here. Another running play. Brown's there to take it down. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Ready, green, ready. And the give now to DeMarco Murray. And gains about one. Murray's able to show everybody why he should get the football more. Good job that time finding his way and picking up a first down. Here we go. Green, ready. Green, ready. The 
Eagles snap it at the 26. And he's forced to the ground. Well, you see it all the time. When the offensive line can't stop the defensive pass rush, then you have your running backs hit a defensive lineman before they go out for the pass. This will be second down. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid Play being sacked green, for a 90, third time. DeMarco Murray gets the handoff. The tackle is made. And with these incredible rushing numbers, it's no surprise to see this team on top. They are dominating on the offensive line. There's no question about that. They're being very physical, and that's why they're leading this football game. Nickel formation here for the defense. Third down and six. Marshall makes the catch. Plenty of zip on that throw. Talk about controlling the flow of the game. Another first down, and the drive keeps on going. Yeah, why not? The defense, they're just sitting over there. They're taking the hits and not even fighting back. Ah, it's a terrible job by the defense. First down at the 42. Sproles, stiff arms to stay on his feet, and Sproles is brought down. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home, they stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. Bradford's got two tight ends on the field for this snap. He's looking to the right here on this throw. He is brought down at the 49-yard line. The Eagles understand just get whatever yards you can every time you run a play. That's what they do that time. It's a short completion, but look what position it puts them here in on third down. This is something they can handle. Here's Ertz. That'll stop the play right there. The old-fashioned way of picking up big yardage is running the fly route on the outside, show the speed of the receiver and the strength of the quarterback's arm. What a nice completion. Still got it after the play action. Underneath and incomplete that time. Second down now. Play after play after play here on this drive. Move 45! Move 45! Handoff made. Halftime is coming up, but first we reach the two-minute warning. Coming up at halftime, please stay tuned for the Verizon Halftime Report, presented by EA Sports. We've got a defense out on that field trying to stand tall and keep this deficit as it is on the scoreboard. This long drive continues. Go, go. Bradford standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Brings it in. And he's going to be tackled. And that's going to bring us to fourth down. Defense now signaling for a timeout. That timeout might be very useful for the offense. They're now ready to go. They bring back out the offense to go for it. They load it up now, bring out the jumbo formation. And that's a two-yard game. Show me a team that can pick up the quarterback stinks on fourth and short, and I'll... I'll show you a team that has a good center and two good guards. They get a good push inside, and the quarterback is able to get the first down. This has been a long drive so far. First down and 10. Gets it again. Murray's hit and brought down. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. The long drive continues. Here we go. Move 45. Move. Murray on the screen. Scores the touchdown. Well, you got a lead. Now you're able to go out there and drive down the field and score a touchdown. This changes how the other team is going to manage the game from here on out.
Eagles for the extra point. And the extra point is good. Murray's over on the sidelines. He was a true dual threat back on that last drive. He did great work in both the passing and running games on that scoring drive. No return here. This will be coming out to the 20. Smith heading back out for this next series. Ivory lined up in the backfield. Smith is in the shotgun. Looking to the right side and throwing. And Wes Welker hauls it in. Throw, throw, They're back throw. at the line after that catch for a first down. Getting set as fast as they can. He'll fire it out to the left. Brings it into his body. They bring him down at the 41-yard line. The Jets use another timeout here, and they have one left. The Jets snap it at the 41. Throws to the right. Catch made. When you're a quarterback throwing against zone defenses, Look for the open space. That's what he did that time. He found it, and the receiver ran in there and made the catch. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. Smith's going to take the snap from the shotgun. On the money. Now they take the football throw, onto throw, the throw. opponent side of the field. Will go no huddle. Second down and four. Makes the reception. He's brought down at the 46. They connect on that pass play, but it's still third down. The defense comes out of the dime. Smith's going to take it from the gun. The Jets now move the chains. The Jets call a timeout here. They have zero timeouts remaining. Offense ready to play after calling a timeout. Back to the air here on first down. It's over to Welker. Pass hits the ground and goes incomplete on the short throw. Second down after the incompletion. Split backfield here. Smith's got it in the gun. He has the grab. He'll try this one from 43. The kick is good. That does it for the first half. Jets trailing this one. For the second half, he's put the ball on the tee and he's about to kick off. Murray's going to test the coverage this time. And he's met head on right there at the 20. The Eagles are ready to take over now as their offense heads onto the field. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. And now here's the first snap of the second half. If you want to run the football with success, you're going to have plays like this where they pick up very little yardage. Don't listen to the fans. Keep running it, and it'll work. Murray lined up in the backfield. Second and 10. He's taken down at the 23. Hey, this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time, they stopped that run just for a short game. Offense lines up here. Three-step drop. Here's Ertz. Another third down conversion. The offense continues to come through in the clutch. What a nice catch by the receiver. Getting past the yard markers, makes the catch, and gets the first down. The defense comes out in the nickel. The Eagles will take the snap from the 35. Sproles is marked down after a gain of four. And 
here we have second down. Nickel formation for the defense here. They call his name again. Brought down at the 41-yard line. This is one good tackling defense. They stay in good position at all times, and we saw at that time when they stopped the play for a short game. DeMarco Murray is in the backfield. Oh, yeah. The Eagles snap it at the 41. He's looking to the right here on this throw. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. Bradford's able to show off the footwork. Wow, what a good job. Look at those feet. Like a dancer. Gets himself in very good position to throw the football. Coming to the line hoping to avoid being sacked now. for a third time. First down at the 46. Marshall's got the catch and the first. Hard to play man-to-man -man against such a quality receiver. You kind of mix up the cover. If you play straight man-to-man, -man, you're going to give up a lot of completions. First down here after the completion. It's an empty backfield for Bradford this time. From the shotgun. Bradford's unable to find his target that time. Quarterbacks love to see a receiver uh, have this type of play. Even though he doesn't make the catch, the effort is outstanding, and he's given everything he has to make that catch. There we go now. Three, three, nine. The Eagles from the 32. Almost intercepted. The defense did everything right in that situation. They were in the right spot. They were smart. They read the quarterback's eyes, but they dropped the pass. Third down. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. The defense gets the sack. The coach is going to go for it. The Eagles from the 37. Eyeing that left side. That's a failed conversion, but you might as well look at it like a turnover. It's going back the other way. Well, I'll give the defense some credit here. They stopped them on fourth and long. Well, they should. Take that back. I'm not giving them any credit. I'm giving the blame to the offense. Bad decision. Geno Smith takes the field for another time. They come out in the dime package. First and ten. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. Games 16. When you're behind in a football game, all you can do on the offensive side is just go out there and thinking about making plays and picking up first downs. Good job by the offense. Geno Smith will take the snap out of the gun. Now first and ten. They're going to get him here for a sack. This might not be nice to say, but every once in a while it's kind of fun to watch the quarterback get sacked like that. Good job by the defensive end. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. Strong eye handoff here. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. Ivory is going to be tired after this run. That is a good long run. The offensive line was terrific, and he does a good job finding the hole and picking up those yards. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. The Jets snap it at the 41. And there's Welker. Welker tackled down. Well, that was a nice job by the offense. It just puts them in a better position. Nice little throw and catch. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. And Ivory's in the backfield. Single back set. Tosses the football. And they bring him down at the 33-yard line. You got to keep your offensive lineman aggressive, so you have to run the football every once in a while. That run, even though it was a short game, it served a purpose. Smith 
Dolphins lined up. Two tight end set. Second down and seven. They'll run it here. Taken down at the 33. Good job by the safety diagnosing the run, getting up outside and making the tackle for a short game. The defense comes out in the dime. Third and seven. The defense gets a sack. Well, the defense has got to be excited. Anytime on third down they make the play, uh, they get pretty fired up. But when you sack a quarterback on third down, that is one happy and emotional defense right now. Andy Lee will be punting this one. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. The Eagles get ready to start their drive. An extra tight end on the field for this one. First down at the 20. Murray. Rocked for a loss on that tackle. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense. And now they have a good situation. Murray lined up in the backfield. Second down and 11. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. Chunk of yardage gained by DeMarco Murray. In a tight game, Bill has been fun watching these two running backs go back and forth, dominating the line of scrimmage. Yeah, the running backs have been dominating so far today. So have both teams' offensive lines. They have gotten it done. And listen, I'll say this to the defense. You better dig in there and toughen up to try to stop these running backs. Brent Selleck makes the catch. Selleck's tackle down at the 22. Well, the way the rules are in the NFL now, you can't hit the receivers, you can't hit the quarterback, and if you give the quarterback this kind of time, he is always going to find an open receiver. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. That was a big gainer. Hey, now it's time to back it up. Keeps it on the play fake. Has his target. Kozlozny sends an animal on that play. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Nickel formation here for the defense. Second and 11. The give. Ball is out. They recover their own fumble. That brings the play to an end. Well, the defense always says, let's call some fumbles. Then when you cause it and you're not able to recover it, that is one emotional letdown. So three quarters in the books, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. I trying to put together a scoring drive here in the fourth. Let's see what they do on this third down situation. It's a two tight end formation. Final quarter underway now with this snap. This offense can't be stopped on third down no matter the distance. Play number six coming up on this drive. First and goal. Gets it out for the completion. Sheards all over that offense and brings him down. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Pass complete, but did not get them the first, so it's second down now. Bradford's back in shotgun formation, and that'll probably go as a drop. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Sam Bradford backing off the line of scrimmage and into the shotgun. On the money. This time, they fail to pick up the first on third down. A rare occurrence here today. Big decision for the coach this time, Jim. You failed on third and goal. What do you do? Do you go for it? I say you call the play and you try to put up seven points. Well, it's a beautiful drive down the field. Long drive by the offense. They do not get the seven points, but they're fortunate. They do get the field goal try, and they make it. 
That'll be a touchback, and the ball will be placed at the 20. Geno Smith heading back out for this next series. Chris Ivory lined up in the backfield. Smith is in the shotgun. Makes the catch in open space. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. Smith standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Had it for a moment, but then lost it on the hit. The Eagles lead right now, but of course a big reason why is that defense has shown up to play. Jim, to win in the NFL, you have to do all three phases of the game the right way. Offense, special teams, and that defense must show up every single week. Good job so far here today. Finds his mark. He'll pick up seven this time. The Jets, a lot of people like to throw screens and run draws. No, they look deep down the field. It's not there. They throw it short. They pick up some good yards. Now they can do what they want, a third run or pass. And nothing there as that was double covered. Well, there's still time to make up the deficit if you don't go for it here on fourth and short near midfield at the uh, end of this game. Uh, I think because it's so short, I think you go for it. You never know what the other offense is going to do. Uh, big decision. We'll see what the coach tries. They face first down. Marshalls lined up in the slot. Here's Ertz. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws, sooner or later, that defense is going to come up. And when they come up, that's when you throw it over the top. Second and six. And the give now to DeMarco Murray. That tackle was made at the 27-yard line. Look at the rushing totals for both sides. Neither defense has had much luck slowing down the run. Well, it's not about luck. It's about trying hard. It's about one-two, and I do not see that from the defensive side. That's why the offenses are having so much success running the football here today. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. The Eagles have really been able to run the ball today. It's been a huge reason why they lead. Murray's been called on, and he has stepped up big time, Phil. Rex Ryan, the coach of the New York Jets, he made this saying almost famous, ground and pound, and that's what's happened here today. They are just grounding the defense into shreds and, and winning so far. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. The Eagles have turned it up a notch with their running game today, Phil. Murray's been a consistent force on the ground. Yeah, he's just a running back who never gives up. When he runs, it's arms, elbows, everything is moving. And he is one tough running back to tackle. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. And Matthews is lined up now as a slot receiver. It's intercepted. Got a big lane. Touchdown. This game is tight. Touchdown to good work. You're talking about getting your team full of emotion and getting everything on your side. How about that interception by the defense and then taking it back all the way for the score? The Jets now getting set for the extra point. Extra point was good. The Eagles kickoff return team is on the field. After seeing their defense surrender some points, the score is 24 to 17. And he's going to give his team great starting field position on that return. There is nothing like a good return when you talk about special teams. Good blocking. The speed of the returner gets down the field, and after that tackle, now they have good starting field position. The Eagles come out for the next possession. The Jets with two extra defensive backs in the dime. First down at the 44. Murray's hit and brought down. 
Well, the defense, they give them a first down there. They're behind. They just can't sit back there and keep bending. You got to take some chances, go on the offensive, Ready. on the defensive Ready. side, and just make things happen. And Sproles gets the football. He's brought to a halt. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Here we go. The Eagles snap it up at the 26. They tackle them at the 26-yard line. After that last carry, it's third and three. It's Marshall. Tackles made, and that'll move the chain. That's awesome. Every time you pick up a first down, what does that do? It shortens the game, also keeps your defense on the sideline, and they get the, get rested up and ready for their turn. But you got a lead here. It's a small one in the second half. Keep getting those first downs. Game's 11. Jim, the defense gives up the first down that time inside the red zone. But there's only so many things the offense can do. Let's see if they can hold him. Well, as the clock is winding down, the offense would like to just run it out. And he's thrown to the ground. That's a bad job by the offense that time. There's no doubt about it. The blitz by the defense. They do not do a good job of finding out where everybody's blitzing from. They let a guy come free. And that free blitzer, or as we call them, free runners, he gets the hit on the QB and takes him down. It's third and goal right here in a close game. This offense, they want to take control. If they score right here, that could give them control of this game. We've hit the two-minute warning in the second half. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Goal line defense on the field. Play fake. Looking to the right side and throwing. And the throw is incomplete. It's third and goal. You don't get it in the end zone. What do you do now? I think you go for it. You call the right play. Give your team a chance to put a touchdown on the board. The field goal try. Yes, sir. Well, that time the offense had great field position. They don't take advantage of it, but at least they get three points. Good job by the kicker coming in and getting some points on the board. They'll take it at the 20. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. First and 10. It's intercepted, and that's going to end the comeback attempt. Nice tackle. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. First down here. The Jets with a nickel look here on defense. DeMarco Murray gets the handoff for a gain of about five. The defense stops the clock. That leads us to second down. To the ground. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. That's a timeout by the defense. Third down now. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. And the timeout is called, so we're going to take a quick break and return in just a moment. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Ready to make the stop on the goal line. Loading up that defensive. Touchdown. You got 
got to give the offensive line just a lot of credit. It's first and goal. They just line up and power the football in there. Nice run, but a great job by the O-line. The Eagles for the extra point. Driving extra point is good. The Eagles defense certainly contributing to the cause here today. And that interception was good enough to lead the offense out for a short field and a score. No return. The ball's coming out to the 20. Geno Smith takes the field for another time. Offense lines up here. Smith is in the shotgun. but can't connect on the short throw. Well, the defense has got to love that. They love it when a quarterback is uneasy for whatever reason or just not in rhythm. That time they see him throw off the back foot and the throw goes incomplete. He's got the catch. And at the 25, he'll be brought down. Going to the hurry up. No timeouts remaining. Makes the reception. The defense has a lead here in the fourth quarter, Jim, so they're willing to give up those short completions. Now it's up to the defense. Come up and make the tackle. Good job that time. Murray's got a chance this time. Breaks out of that one. A rack pose there to make the stop. Eagles ready now to start their next series. Take it here from the 30. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Well, even though they have a lead here, it's late in the fourth quarter. You still got to be unpredictable. Keep the defense on edge. As I always say, make the defense react and not attack. So make them guess what plays you're going to run. Second and nine. They'll go ground. Sheldon Richardson able to bring him down. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. DeMarco Murray is in the backfield. They hand it off to him again. Games 12. Good job by the offense here with a good lead in the second half, picking up that first down, and that's what you want to do. Take your time, look at the play clock, take it down as low as you can, and keep picking up those first downs. First down here after the run. The Eagles are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. back and the offense is ready to roll after the timeout new set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground Marshall's gonna get set in the slot for the snap Sam Bradford going down the field and it's picked off by Cromarty he stacked up at that point how much sweeter is practice going to be this week after the win on that sideline? Once you win, practice is easier because your confidence is high. You feel good about what you've done from the previous week because you won. So I think it always gives you a better chance of winning the following week because you feel so good when you're out there in that practice field. memorable game this truly was for Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now and we leave you with the GMC never say never moment of the game.